The Central African Empire French, Empire Centrafricaine, was a short-lived absolute monarchy under a one-party military dictatorship, that replaced the Central African Republic and was, in turn, replaced by the restoration of the Republic. The empire was formed by and under the command of Jean Badel Bikasa, President of the Republic, who declared himself Emperor Bikasa I on 4 December 1976. Bikasa spent the equivalent of over US 20 million United States dollars, a third of the country's government annual income, on his coronation ceremony. The monarchy was abolished and the name, Central African Republic, was restored on 21 September 1979, when Bikasa was ousted with French support. His palace was neglected. History Proclamation In September 1976, Bikasa dissolved the government and replaced it with the Conseil de la Révolution Centrafricaine Central African Revolutionary Council. On 4 December 1976, at the Messon Congress, Bikasa instituted a new constitution, converted back to Roman Catholicism he had briefly become a Muslim earlier in the year and declared the republic to be a monarchy, the Central African Empire. He had himself crowned SMI, Bikasa one er with SMI standing for Sa Majesté Imperiale, His Imperial Majesty, on 4 December 1977. Bikasa's full title was Emperor de Centrafrique par la volonté du pupil centrafricain, uni au sein du parti politique national, la Messon. Emperor of Central Africa by the will of the Central African people, united within the National Political Party, the Messon. His regalia, lavish coronation ceremony and regime were largely inspired by Napoleon I, who had converted the French First Republic, of which he was first consul, into the First French Empire. The coronation ceremony was estimated to cost his country roughly $20 million one third of the country's budget and all of France's aid for that year. Bikasa attempted to justify his actions by claiming that creating a monarchy would help Central Africa stand out from the rest of the continent, and earn the world's respect. Despite invitations, no foreign leaders attended the event. Many thought Bikasa was insane, and compared his egotistical extravagance with that of Africa's other well-known eccentric dictator, Field Marshal Idi Amin. Although it was claimed that the new empire would be a constitutional monarchy, in practice the country remained a military dictatorship. Emperor Bikasa retained the dictatorial powers he had possessed as president, and Messon remained the only legally permitted party. Suppression of dissenters remained widespread, and torture was said to be especially rampant. It was subsequently proven at trial that Bikasa himself occasionally participated in beatings. Topic. Overthrow By January 1979, French support for Bikasa had all but eroded after riots in Bangui led to a massacre of civilians. Between 17 and 19 April, a number of high school students were arrested after they had protested against wearing the expensive, government required school uniforms. Around 100 were killed. Bikasa allegedly participated in the massacre, beating some of the children to death with his cane. However, the initial reports received by Amnesty International indicated only that the school students suffocated or were beaten to death while being forced into a small cell following their arrest. The massive press coverage which followed the deaths of the students opened the way for a successful coup which saw French troops in Operation Barracuda restore former President David Dako to power while Bikasa was away in Libya meeting with Gaddafi on 20 September 1979. Bikasa's overthrow by the French government was called France's last colonial expedition by veteran French diplomat Jacques Fockert. Operation Barracuda began the night of 20 September and ended early the next morning. An undercover commando squad from the French intelligence agency SDECE now DGSE, joined by Special Foss's 1st Marine Infantry Parachute Regiment, or 1ER RPIMA, led by Colonel Branchon Rouge, landed by Transall C-160 and managed to secure the Bangui M. Poco Airport. 
Upon arrival of two more transport aircraft, a message was sent to Colonel Digen to come in with his Barracudas codename for eight Puma helicopters and Transall aircraft, which took off from N'Djamena Military Airport in neighboring Chad. By 12.30 p.m. on 21 September 1979, the pro-French Daco proclaimed the fall of the Central African Empire. David Daco remained president until he was overthrown on 1 September 1981 by General André Kolingba. In 2009 Jean Serge Bacasa, who was seven years old when the emperor was overthrown, stated his father's reign was indefensible. If taken as legitimate, the Central African emperor is the most recent emperor to be overthrown, leaving the emperor of Japan as the sole remaining monarch to use the title. The most recently abolished empire which survived beyond its first emperor is Iran. Topic. Coinage. The only coin bearing the name Empire Centrafricaine was a 100 CFA francs dated 1978. See also Saint Sylvestre coup d'état References External links Jules Verne stamp Luigi Pirandello stamp Imperial stamp example Imperial currency example Imperial flag <laughs>